Oh, yeah. Sweet, sweet summertime. That's right. America's favorite sucky fisherman is back with another episode of Southern Bowie Outdoors. I hope y'all are having a wonderful weekend. Look at that sunset in that back window. Sorry, that's my, my what do they call it, uh, ADHD or whatever kicking in. <laughs> uh, hope you had a wonderful weekend. I hope you're staying cool out there. It's hot, man. It's hot. Y'all get in the swim pool, get in the lake, do something. Watch out for that old heat stroke. That's bad news. No, none of us need that. But I hope you're having a great weekend. We caught a couple little old fish this weekend. Wasn't a real, real special trip, but it's a daggum hot right now. It's hard to catch anything. Anyway, on with the show. Y'all like, subscribe, tell your mama and them about us, and please, please, please ring that bell. Excuse me, Captain Kelly. Why am I not catching fish? Um, because you're a sucky fisherman. Uh, no. Somebody had rewired it for a 36 volt trolling motor. So I had to wire it back to a 24, but everything was gone. So I had to start from scratch. Of course, I just crisscrossed my batteries in the back and um, does fine. Runs on 12 or 24, and your foot pedal switch is what controls your 12, 24. So, uh, there's my neighbor, there's my mailman. Man, I'm supposed to go fishing one day or hang out on the lake. So I will be right back. I gotta say hi to him. Uh, I love him to death. Uh, he's out running his route this morning and I guess swapping his packages around and putting them in the front to where when he gets to the houses it makes it a little bit quicker. He stopped there at the end of my road. So my mailman, he's, he's a cool dude. So anyway, we're gonna try to catch a big old large mouth this morning. Small mouth, Kentucky, something. Uh, we may do good, we may not, but with it being overcast like it is, I wish I'd have been out here a couple hours earlier. But I had a lot of errands to run this morning, a lot of stuff to do. And when it was all said and done, I had to run through the shower because I was just covered in sweat. And I was starting to gross myself out. So, anyway, let's get up here and see what we can get in there.
good. Somebody come and clean the wood up. I'm glad. Man, that water's low. Crazy low. back here before. The cranes are back here working and looking for food. That's a good sign. The cranes is back here. There's bait fish back here. Yeah, buddy. Should have stopped and got gas, so I've got enough to get through today. They hit a, a lot of wind. There's white capping out there in a spot or two. I felt like I was on a big adventure. All right, let's catch a fish. Are we gonna do any good up in here or not? It's hard to fish this. We're gonna fish this really fast. I'm not even on the trolling motor. My foot resting on it, that's it. One land there on that stump. That tree. Got so much current. I came up. I fish it. Man, where's trolling motor battery out today? There's bass on this river. People say they ain't, but they is. There's some big bass on this river. You can just find them. You gotta know where to go. And I've caught a few little ones down through here, but I didn't have as much current and wind to deal with. So that makes a big difference. Boy, that, that super flute's working pretty in that current. Pull something off. Usually you'll see little bass laying around these banks, and you get a decent sign. I ain't even seen a blue yet. Another worrying me to death. Yeah, we're going to find some calmer water. Well, my GoPro 8 died on me. It's charging, and I got the 360 back out. I was having a couple cameras. You see my old prehistoric GoPro back here on the motor. Uh, we're going to ride down here to a couple of little places. But I like to fish and see what we can do. I've got mixed feelings on where I want to go. So I'll just hang on. Hang on tight. We're going to let it rip. Hey, little buddy. 
Ooh. Hey, little buddy. What's your name? What is your little name? Boy, he's pretty. Oh, he's hooked, too. Whew. I mean, it ain't nothing spectacular, but... All right, hoss. You have a good day. I'll tell your buddies that I'll let them go if they'll let me catch them. I didn't show it, but I washed this creek out. It was full of leaves and trash and kind of stagnated water. So I quarter throttled it with a nose up, washed all that mess out to the banks. Then it calmed down just a few minutes. Sometimes when fish ain't biting, believe it or not, you can stir that water up and it'll get them kind of active. I guess it gets a little oxygen in, oxygen in the water. It gets the water to turn it. And a lot of times it'll make them start biting. Not all the time. Sometimes it'll, it'll just ruin your day because you wasn't catching nothing you dang sure ain't now. But sometimes it will get them active. So we'll see what it does. I'm gonna let it calm down just a minute. Finish my fancy bottle of water and uh, see if we can't catch one or two up in here. We don't do no good here. I got one more spot on this river. And it's my other go-to spot. If we don't do no good there, I don't know what you got to do. I guess you got to bribe them. Mm, damn. Wasn't paying no attention. Doggone it. Got him. Got him. Hey, little buddy. Hey, little buddy. You barely got him. But it's all right. There. That, that looks just like the other, don't it? Ain't a nickel's worth of difference in the two. Look wherever you can see it. Just like the other one. Hey, little bud. You sure are pretty. Mm. All right. <laughs> like I said before, I don't like change. And uh, if I've caught fish on a bait the last few times, I want to just wear that bait out. I, I've got to get out of that. I'd catch a lot more fish if I would. Kind of mix it up a little bit more. But it just depends on the time of the year and what I'm fishing for, you know. I do mix it up. It depends on if I'm fishing for stripe. I'm using a road runner with a spinner and a little old twister tail. Or what's called a, there's a little silver, kind of a rattle trap. It's called a gay blade. You can still find them. They're rare. They're hard to find anymore. But they'll catch stripe. But I mean, I might get on a kick where I'm fishing a lizard, and that's all I want to fish. Or I'll get on a kick where I'm fishing, you know, a fluke or a tube or a worm. You know, I just, I'm funny like that. I wish I wasn't that way. Caught a couple fish, had a really good day. We're not done yet, but I'm getting hungry. I hadn't eaten all day, so let's see what uh, what we got going on here. I made a stop at the dollar store. I was getting hungry when I was coming out on the water. And, uh, you know, dollar store is a good place. I like it. Kelly's a big Aldi fan. I'm a big dollar store fan. So uh, if you want to shop where the pros shop and what the pros eat, Doritos, sweet. Spicy chili, spicy sweet chili. The veinous. It's a good day. And I've got that garlic spray on my hand. That ought to really make these veinous taste good. So, 
All right, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a snack and uh, chill out for just a minute. Then I'm gonna fish on down this bank and we're gonna hit another spot or two. And the mosquito has bit my foot. Oh, it's awful. Hit another spot or two and probably call it a day. Get the big boat out. Subscribe, tell your mama and them about us, and ring that bell.